at Season 3, uh, One Miner's Grave. Uh, we got 12 people this time, it's for all, every band for himself. Uh, this is Diamondless, Berg is flying, uh, which basically means that players drop 4 gold and 1 diamond when they die. Uh, you cannot mine diamond, although you can get it from structures, and half of gold you can mine, but the other half will turn into poisonous potatoes. So, anybody have anything to say? Don't eat the I poisonous this was potatoes. Miners to Mention Tony's? the enchanting setup. Yes, I, I was going to when we went into the other room. Oh, sorry. I'll, I'll show that in a second. Um, so, this season, uh, Kevin is playing, who wasn't last season, or the Welcome season back. Before. Yay. Are you gonna say anything? Ah, uh, no. Nope, I'm good. He's a hipster. <laughs> if you don't know me, fuck yeah. If you do know me, hello. Alright. Yep. So, should we go around or no? Introducing no. people? I think yeah. they know us by now. I think we yeah. Nobody I knows they're, I mean us. Is stupid. Time, just look at me and introduce me. No one cares about anyone else. This guy is Bert. Yes! Alright, let's go and see the enchanting setup. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where it is. Oh, doing. That's good. Hey! Oh, climb. What, it's over where here. are you going? It's right doing. Here. What? Why is everyone following you? Why is There's everyone... a door in it. He's... <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. I'm gonna escape to this. Fancy. Uh, I'm on fire. How long till people start dying in the lava? Oh. See, Matt? What the hell, man? So this is the enchanting setup. You can use the levers on the sides to change the levels that you can get from the setup. And it'll be around zero zero. It's not quite at it because there's water there. Ocean biome? Yeah. Well, I, I, yeah, something like that. I've issued a challenge. I've told everyone that they can they can cactus me from the start. Uh, I might regret that later, but since I'm starting in a corner, I feel a little bit more safer saying that. Uh, <laughs> I might, yeah, could regret that. All right, any second we should be starting. Okay. So, as stated in the intro, this is a diamondless game, which means that there's no uh, generated diamond in the world, or it might show up, but it drops silverfish. Either it was replaced with silverfish blocks, or there's a plugin that makes it drop silverfish, I'm not sure which. Um, but, yeah, so, caving for diamonds is useless. The only way to get diamonds is via PvP kills, and there's an enchanting setup near the center of the map. Oh wow, chickens and cows side by side. Oh wait, this is cheaty sand. Let's get off that. Alright. Yes, so that's where we'll need to go, near the center of the map, which is we're as far from that as possible at the moment. But if we want to get enchantments, that will, that's what we'll have to do. And I'm sure people will try to trap it and camp it and whatever else. After certain points, we gotta be careful with that. Um, also, all gold on the map will have 50% chance of dropping poisonous potatoes. You know, basically worthless joke stuff. So, um, yeah. We'll try not to place down any gold that we pick up. Would not be a wise thing to do. And, on the whole, the most reliable way to get the best stuff is actually PvP. Um, still, caving isn't completely useless. Uh, it's still quite a bit safer than PvP, so... Yeah, as far as gold goes, I, I don't know if that'll be worth it. Um, just try to get basically set up here before we head off towards the center and into danger. And everything else should be fairly basic. Uh, I can't do my normal editing style in this video because it is a recorded round. It must be editing free and it is my first time playing in a free-for-all recorded round. 
So that means the pressure is really on at this point. Um, yeah, I've also got to record later on today, and I am recovering from an hour of sleep. <laughs> uh, total, stretched out across a couple hours, just intermittently waking up and napping, basically. And uh, I don't know if that will improve or worsen my commentary. It depends on what kind of tired I am. There are different levels of tired. At a certain point, it actually probably makes me more entertaining because I just say crazy stuff. And that can be fun. I'll just try not to say anything to uh, insult anyone in the game this time. Uh, I'm, I'm referencing something, an old video of mine, which I had a similar problem and just kept yammering on the entire time and I had to cut something. But... <laughs> No one knows about that, so why bring it up? Okay. Killing cows and chickens. I'm just gonna be slaughtering animals for a while here. I wanna get everything that I can. Of course, I don't really need the leather since the enchanting setup's already there. I doubt I'll be making my own. If I get two diamonds from PvP kills, I'm probably... I'd probably be better off investing that in a sword. Although, a private enchanting table might not be a horrible thing. I don't know. We'll see. Um, and yeah, like I said at the start, I, uh, I kind of openly invited anyone to cactus me. <laughs> so, uh, after saying something like that, I, I've got to probably expect that to happen if anyone sees me. So, I'll try to stay alert. Hmm, is that all the chickens? Have we gotten all the chickens from around here? I'd like to see more chickens. We may not. That's a shame. Oh well. With all the leather we're going to be getting, I guess, might as well... Oh wait, more chickens. Might as well make some leather armor, even though people usually uh, frown on that sort of thing. It's it's fine. I, n I never get diamonds. In a diamondless game, I will expect I'll be even less likely to get diamonds, so... Yeah, that'll be cool. Oh boy. Um, gotta think about caving. This looks nice. Yeah. Looks looks lovely. We might go there later. Especially since it's out of the way and all that. Did I wait for those leaves? Hmm. I really need to check for apples, too. That's gonna be important. Yes, I will get that chicken. And those reeds. I could answer him right now, but I'm busy chopping. Okay, there we go. Berg got it anyways. Good guy, Berg. Always, uh, being helpful towards other people. That's a good thing. <laughs> uh, need reeds, and I also need to go back and see if uh, any of those trees dropped apples. Might need to collect a bit more wood anyways. Yeah, probably won't use these. But, who knows. I could make an enchanted book. Uh, for anvil purposes. That can sometimes be useful. So, yeah. We'll try that, I suppose. It's really good if you're upgrading, uh, upgrading weapons that are already at, like, a level 1 enchantment. The books kind of pay off there, because they usually turn out to be a bit cheaper than combining weapons. Like, two weapons. Just combine one weapon and one book tends to save you a little bit, because it doesn't charge you for the durability or whatever. Or at least I'm saying that from my experience of doing that one time in UHC, and getting like a, a power 2 bow for a total cost of 4 levels across the bow and the book and combining them. Not seeing any apples. Why did I do that? Why did I leave that like that? Did I get first damage? No, I didn't. I didn't get first damage, but I have the most damage right now. Hmm. Kiwi, my fellow cactus knights. Took a half heart before that. Hmm. Try not to be... Yeah, um, that, that should give you a good idea of my general... Um, 
my general skill level, and I've only been getting progressively worse over the past few last few games I've played. Um, see, I don't expect a great game from me, but I'll try to make it entertaining at least. Won't spend too much time uh, in caves and all that. I don't know if I should cave closer to the wall or go in this one. Let's check this out, see if it's interesting. Might go ahead and dig down here, because I've pretty much got everything I'd ever want to get from the surface. Norm normally people might try to cover more ground than this, but... Yeah, I'm doing pretty well. As a matter of fact, let me get enough leather to make a full suit of armor. Maybe plus one for... A hypothetical book that we might make at some point and then I'll go down and start caving just a little bit before the nightfall maybe get a head start we've only got 90 minutes to do everything we want to do and chancing and all that and then I think there's some kind of sudden death type thing or meetup I don't know a little fuzzy on the details but should be fun you may notice that um, not everyone from the previous season made it to this one. Uh, quite a few people didn't make it, including including some uh, friends of mine. That's um, it's not like they weren't invited. Uh, it's just that um, this is a slightly different format. Um, in some cases, people just uh, were busy or. We're having uh, technical issues or scheduling issues, and and I think some case in some cases people were kind of uh, scared away by the free for all formats, depending on the person. But yes, everyone was invited, so don't be alarmed. And I'm sure many of your favorites will be back in future seasons at some point in the distant future. I hope so. <laughs> Alright. Let's move on to a cave somewhere. You know what, let's go back to where we were. I don't think what I thought was a cave was actually a cave. And the sun's setting. And we're gonna not have time to do stuff. Yes, I've taken damage. I'm aware. Obvious trolling is obvious, but I feel it's like a required part of the game. Whenever you're doing free for all battles, you have to you have to make very obvious lies in the chat for everyone to chuckle over, <laughs> right? Seems to be seems to be the way things go. Um, where was that cave that I saw before over in this area? Somewhere around here. Was this it? Was the, are the lighting glitches? I don't think so. No. I don't think there will be a lighting glitch where I saw the cave. Maybe that there's some stone over there. Alright. Um, is that it or that? I don't know. I just need to find a hole quickly. Try not to take fall damage. Again. Okay. Um, this looks like a good place to start. Actually, no, it's not. Skeleton noise. Okay, let's get down and get covered up somewhere. Shit, shit, shit. I hear him walking. I don't like that sound. Okay, time to put blocks. That's totally not obvious that there's someone here, right? Definitely not. Um, more blocks. More blocks. We're blocks. Okay, we're blocked in. And we're also a prime target for anyone who happens to see all that mess. All 
right. I think the moment has passed. Possibly only temporarily. Oh, wow. We've got a lot of stuff. A lot of steak stuff. That's good. I don't even think we need this chicken flesh. So, goodbye. <gasps> okay. Um, let's not do that. Let's get some cobblestone. Make this a little bit safer. We got iron nearby. Okay, let's try to just do this one piece at a time here. Blocking stuff and lighting stuff. Try to make this safe. Skeleton noises make me uncomfortable. That's in an adjacent cave. We gotta keep that in mind. Possibly whenever we explore that other branch, we'll find that guy. And I'm not really looking forward to it. <sighs> Skeletons are not nice. There's a cow in this cave. Okay. I think I want to make this armor quickly. Yeah. That's something I kind of spaced. Let's not space. Oh, boy. Here, we're going to block this bit. So if any of things up there won't have a line of sight directly to us whenever we walk around that area. Um, we're going to make another furnace real quick for iron. Plus, it's just good to have a second furnace in general. Um, yeah, we got plenty of coal in our future. We could use a little bit more cobblestone. We need to make some extra tools. Let's go ahead and make a suit of armor, because I feel like I'm going to get ambushed any second here. Okay. Have that at least. It'll give us a little bit of protection. Um, lots of mob noises going on. Doesn't make me feel too comfortable. Okay, it sounds like they're actually up on the surface. That's a bit better. I wonder if there's one on top of this gravel block where I can trap him. Doesn't appear to be. Okay. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and make the sword now. And I'm not sure if I need to make a pick or a bucket next. Both of those things will be useful. Um, let's get... Ah, move, mouse, move. That'll work. And... So this... I guess I'll go ahead and make another stone pick for now. And we could probably use some other tools. Lots and lots of mob noises around here. Um, what else am I going to need? I guess that's fine for now. Also, we won't need this stone sword anymore. Okay. Let's dig around here. Right. Okay, we're all set. Is that a thing? Oh, it's a cow. Okay. Come on. Come on. Alright. Okay, here's where being up against the wall is a bit helpful. Kind of blocks off some of the caves that might have been unsafe on the side. Of course, it also means there's less cave to explore in total. But I don't mind it just being one tunnel at a time, really. 
not super interested in allowing anything up there to come where I am at the moment. I think that should do it. Alright, water should help keep mobs back here. Could be helpful. Um, we're gonna go ahead and collect some more of this stuff. Iron is nice to have. I'm still hearing skeleton noises and it makes me very uncomfortable. We're gonna... Oh god, this cow needs to die. Okay. Flint, 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 flint. We're gonna use this for various purposes. Which you can probably guess if you know me. And I really need coal. Oh, there's some. Oh, here's some too. Alright. All helpful things. Now, I'm probably... Yeah, I've got a little ways to go before we're at gold layer. That will be next priority after I get a bit more iron. Of course, an anvil would be nice too, since we're guaranteed to at least have access to enchanting setups. Um, yeah, it could be a good thing to get a hold of. Anvils, that is. Um, we can leave this uncooked for now. We're too close to the surface, man. All these mob sounds freak me out. Alright. Goodbye, flower. Hmm. Yeah, I think I will go ahead and make one of these. And... A... Pick. Or no, bucket. Yeah, bucket. It's better. I don't use buckets often enough in the UHC, and I have paid the price for it in the past, so we're going to try to remedy that this time. At least with the water bucket. Lava buckets are nice for uh, PvE, I know. Shit! I think the water's throwing them off. I should seize the opportunity, right? Right? There's one more hit. Oh, yes. Give me your bones. Give me your bones. This could be useful. Ooh, and it's another cave. 